everyone, this is Kat. Um, honestly, the whole thing with Chanel and Brandt where they were being lied about in public, on a public live stream, I mean, if that's acceptable in the truth or community, that really inspires new questions. Can we honestly say that we have a love of the truth? Is this is going to just fly under the theater and everybody just accepts whatever lies that are being told by Jane? And the fact is that Harbinger of the Harvest seems bent on spreading those lies as well. That's not right. It might be being called slanderous for pointing out the fact that Jane and Harbinger aren't being entirely honest. But I'm not the one who got up on a public live stream with EYA and told, told nothing but lies the way Jane did. So, I mean, honestly, what I'm doing is hardly slander in comparison. I've also been called very divisive for pointing out the fact that people chose to lie. But again, it's not my fault that they chose to lie, and it's not, it's not okay to defend the fact that people are lying in the Mandela Effect community. It's not. This is the truth through community, supposedly. We're supposed to be loving the truth and seeking the truth out on all matters. If you're gonna call a device who actually bothered to do that, then don't call yourself a truther. It's just enough set. The fact of the matter is, if we continue to excuse lies like this, and how can we ever expect others to even consider our ideas? We're supposed to be a true, a community all about the truth, yet lies are being told, and that's supposed to be okay, and I'm spiritually mature for not accepting that? No way. That's nonsense. It really is. If we want people to look at our ideas and even consider them, we can, then we can't go on public live streams to lie about people. That won't score us brownie points at all. We have to be looking for the truth in all matters, not just the ones that suit our fancies. That's all I have to say for this video. See you guys next time.